Prince Charles has tested positive for coronavirus and is now self-isolating. The Prince of Wales and the Duchess of Cornwall attended an event held by the British Asian Trust in London last night. A warning, these pictures do contain flash photography. Well, the Chancellor, Rishi Sunak, and the Home Secretary, Priti Patel, were among the dignitaries with the royal couple and they were pictured shaking hands. It was their first public engagement since the Queen expressed her wish for Camilla to be known as Queen Consort when Charles becomes King. Our royal correspondent, Rhiannon Mills, joins me now. One would imagine that the royal family are being tested relatively frequently, Rhiannon, and this was a test that he received this morning. Right throughout the pandemic, they have done what they can to try and set the right example. But I think the fact that Charles and Camilla were at that big event last night, mixing as they're expected to do, um, I think shows that this has kind of come out of the blue a bit. We're still waiting to find out whether or not uh, it just came about because he was given a test and all of a sudden he's now realised that he's got COVID or whether he is suffering from any symptoms or not. We're still waiting for those details uh, from the palace. But in a tweet a short while ago, uh, they said that the Prince of Wales has tested positive for COVID-19. Uh, they said that he is now self-isolating. And they also say that HRH is deeply disappointed not to be able to attend today's events in Winchester and is going to look to reschedule his visit as soon as possible. Because, of course, right throughout the pandemic, the Royals were restricted, really, and what they could do. They were having to do lots of Zoom engagements and things like that. So as soon as any lockdown restrictions started to ease, they've been keen to get out and about and meet as many people as possible. Of course, with that now comes meeting more people, not wearing face masks. And so in some ways, they are very exposed when it comes to potentially um, contracting COVID-19. Worth saying, though, we know that uh, the Prince of Wales has received both of his jabs and his booster jab, and both him and Camilla have been real advocates when it comes to pushing uh, the vaccination programme. But yet, yeah, at the moment, we're still waiting to find out whether or not he is uh, suffering from any symptoms, but just to confirm he is now uh, self-isolating. And yeah, very disappointed that he won't be able to carry out those engagements in Winchester today.